Good morning. Sardine news with a bit of a flash flood update. Margaret took a hiding to nowhere from an amazing three or four hours of intense, intense rain and intense lightning, which eventually did knock the power out. But here is a whole bunch of videos, and don't go to Margaret today. Give the others a chance to, to wrap it up. The pillar's gone. The pillar that had the grove sign is gone off the corner of the building here. And um, here in front of the grove, you can see the concrete bollard there is bent. You can see how deep the water is going down here in front of the grove. Okay, so Margaret got hammered from about 3 in the afternoon all the way through the night. They really took strain. That storm seemed to have focused on Margaret because the other rivers like Yom Kulu didn't really even come down in flood at all. But the main thing is, don't go swimming in this water. This is the water that carries, unfortunately, sewage. And the sewage is not treated because of load shedding all these years. And the stuff that's in that sewage is the drugs that people take. And those drugs for medicine and all kinds of stuff end up in the river with the pathogens. So the pathogens get a chance to actually become immune to the drugs in these estuaries because there's no functioning sewage system or it hasn't been for the last 10 years or so. I know that load shedding has stopped now, but still, do not go swimming. All right, now we're just going to have a look at uh, the aftermath of how this all turned out. So the robot barn, the long front, on portal. Take care.